It's time to get our first finalist onto the ice. Last week he got six after six after six. So remind me never to play him at Monopoly. It's Kieran Bracken. <laughs> Jason six, Karen six, Robin six, it's the highest ever score in Dancing on Ice. That was the performance of a finalist. Saturday night was awesome and I am so excited about the final. Having finally found their feet on the ice, this week's mission will quite literally leave our celebrities on a high. There's lots of things that you're trying to control. First of all, you, you want your safety. But then after that, you've got to get used to the motion. You can practice as much as you want, but effectively on the night, you're not quite sure what's going to happen. We've had a little surprise. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Suspended 18 feet off the ground and moving up to five metres per second, this routine will be tough. <laughs> you hoo oh! That is wicked. It's like going to Alton Towers, isn't it? Whoa. Ta -da -da. She just said my shoulders won't fit through that. <laughs> <laughs> left, right, left. But it seems that Kieran's no Tinkerbell. Left, right, left. <laughs> yeah, I think it's too fast. <laughs> Kieran's not the most comfortable in the harness and how he does it. That's yeah. it. That's it. <laughs> He's getting a little bit more elegant now in the air than he was when he first started. A little. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, looking graceful is so far removed from what I do being a rugby player. Flying in sequence, you can imagine the text I'm going to get from the boys. Land. <laughs> like that. Skating and flying to come fly with me, it's Melanie Lambert and Kieran Bracken. Some exotic booze, or there's a bar in far Bombay. Come on and fly with me. Let's fly, let's fly away. Come fly with me, let's float down to Peru. In Lama Land, there's a one-man band, and he'll toot his flute for you. Come on, fly with me, let's take off. In a blue Once I get you up there I'll be holding you so near You may hear All the angels cheer Because we're together Weather-wise It's such a cuckoo day You just say those words And we'll take our birds down to a a blue gold bay, it's so perfect for a flying honeymoon. Oh, babe, come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly. And don't tell your mama. Lands the only way to fly without contributing to global warming. No dangerous emissions. Top scorer for five weeks with our best ever score of 29.5 and four sixes last week. But those wires were cutting into Kieran's shoulders like a cheese slicer. The back somersaults at the start of the program. Not easy to be balletic when you're a 14 stone rugby union scrum half. And then the embrace, Superman carrying away Lois Lane in a safe pair of hands. And then another back somersault, Melanie's outfit tonight, lovely pastel shades of champagne orange and sugar glow. Well, here's the first set of marks. Nikki, five. Natalia, 5.5. Jason, 4.5. Karen, five. 
Robin five. That gives him a total of 25. Thank you, Tony. 25, our first score of the evening. <laughs> How was that? <laughs> that? That was probably the best one we've done. <laughs> yeah. I mean, to be honest, get, I mean, I'm, I'm sort of, I don't know, if two foot wide and that's one and a half. So the, you know, the dimensions don't really work for so me. you but couldn't get through the wires. Get through wires. That's so actually the first time you've got yeah, through, I think, isn't it? Yeah. The shoulders are so <laughs> yeah. wide that yeah. I was so nervous he was going to get stuck up yeah. there. So. Well, they, I wouldn't have thought there's many rugby players could be as graceful no. as that. <laughs> he did great tonight, yeah. He was, um, in the week, we've struggled a little bit, but it all came together tonight, so that's great. Well done. OK, well done to you. So look at <laughs> right, well, let's, uh, let's see what the judges have to say. Holly? Well, a great score. It all seems to come together on the night. Nikki, what did you think? Um, I thought you did really well. To come from nothing and to be doing this is great. Control on the somersaults was good. Just a couple of the transitions were a little stilted for me. So at this level now we're looking for everything to flow through. But other than that, I thought Mel, you did a great job moving him around. It's a different dynamic for the female to be moving the man around and she did a great job. You were flying out there and, and you're not quite as graceful as you could be yet, but you're getting there. Thank you. Thanks, Nikki. Natalia, top scores from you, 5.5. I, my scores is for, uh, for his uh, talent like actor, because his line was not great on flying kick, but his uh, act was perfect. Thank you, Natalia. And Jason, the low score coming from you. I mean, it wasn't, you know, the most sprightly of flying that we've seen. You know, I mean, it was, <laughs> it was a little clumpy, and some of, the, some of the lines in the air, Kieran, were not at all graceful and they certainly didn't flow. Um, it, was, it was interesting, that embrace, that Superman embrace that we talked about, it kind of looked to me as though you were stripping her neck or something, like you were eating her, like some sort of fruit flat. Yeah, um, but I think Mel, you did a great job because he is a, a hulk of a man and I mean, overall, you did very well considering that you have never flown before. Thank you, Jason, thank you, judges. Very good. Stripping her neck, eh? Some would say that was romantic. And those acting lessons obviously paid off as well. If you think Kieran's got off to a flying start and you want to see him skate Bolero, then you can vote for him when the lines open shortly. Kieran and Melanie! <laughs> Still to come, Duncan James reaches new heights. And how will Claire take to the air? Find out after the break.